Fairhope High School and every other public school campus in the state of Alabama prepares for a short week. For some kids, there is an upside. Because I love my mom and I want to spend more time with her. Older students like Riley look forward to the break, but the time off might shave points off upcoming tests. It's also kind of scary thinking about I might be going back to AP exams and I won't be prepared. For a lot of working parents, it could be a struggle to find last minute childcare, especially for this long of a time period. And for a lot of parents I spoke with, they're coping as best they can. Kind of crazy, I don't know. I think everything's being blown a little out of proportion. Mm -hmm. But um, I don't know, I'll get to spend more time with my kids, so that's a plus. It's a tough decision being weighed by parents and caregivers. Is this too much time or not enough time? I feel we have to do whatever necessary for this country, keep them safe. Baldwin County Schools will roll spring break into the state of emergency, meaning classes are out for nearly a month, from March 18th to April 13th. Mobile County resumes a week earlier. In Fairhope, Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.